Uh, let's have a look at uh, setting up title blocks. Um, it's a fairly large area in ARCHICAD, but we I'll, I'll just sort of try and give you a fairly quick, broad overview. Um, uh, the first thing I want to do is point out that in the file menu, there is a section in there called Info. And once you go there, you can go to uh, Project Info. And I've just added a couple of things in here just for a demonstration to show you how they eventually work. But in each one of these areas, you can um, add in your own information. Um, what I am doing here is adding in uh, things like the project name, the project number, uh, my number, um, uh, uh, sorry, the, uh, the, the name of the architect. If, uh, if you're doing a project, you can put your own name in there. Um, and what uh, the purpose of this is, is, is you add the information in once, and then uh, when you start to create a title block, it will add this information in automatically, or you can lay out this information in automatically. You don't have to keep adding it to each sheet but it will um, it will update so as you change the information here it automatically updates all the information in your master title block and then if that's applied to all your drawings then all your drawings automatically get updated so that's the first thing you need to know is that there is um, this project info dialog box um, next let's have a look at setting up a title block I'm in the navigator palette I'll double click the uh, grey box there that says uh, master layout uh, you'll notice that uh, this one here um, we can change or you can add a new title block so let's add a new one I'm going to click a uh, new master layout the grey box here and I'll call this one say A3 A3 master layout um, choose one of the standard metric sheets of paper here A3 landscape you can choose margins 15 mils fairly big I usually um, set that to 5 mils maybe leave this one at 15 um, and um, that one at 5 as well um, ok so let's create that uh, there it is here and what we want to do now is draw in our title block now title blocks normally um, standard ones normally are either across the bottom or across the uh, right hand side of the drawing I'm going to use my line tool um, notice by the way that all the tools some of the tools have been grayed out the only ones available to you are the ones you can use in this area of ARCHICAD which are all the 2D tools so in the line tool I'm going to pick a rectangle and draw a rectangle that represents um, the title block um, you can set it to a single line and then break up that title block in a number of different sections so that you can add all the information in. So a standard title block needs to have things like the project number, the project name, the client's number, uh, the client's name, um, drawing number, the date, the time, things like that. You can even go and add uh, a logo or a piece of graphic so for example I've got one here that I um, created earlier um, this is just in a JPEG format I can grab an image like this and uh, I think I've shown you before you can just drag and drop it onto your layout uh, the way I'm doing there once it's uh, there um, what you can do is select that image and under the edit pull down menu there is a command called reshape and then if you go down to resize um, you'll be able to say OK and use this default setting and then click um, in one corner click in the other corner 
and then just drag the size down to something that fits your title block. Uh, and then I'm going to control D on the keyboard and drag that logo uh, where you'd like it to be on your title block. Um, zooming in you can see it's uh, sitting there. And then um, what you do is you use your uh, text tool, this one. Uh, if you open up your text tool, double click, um, you can set the sizes and scale uh, the size and the font that you want um, and then it's a matter of um, adding in uh, text blocks in here so I'm clicking and dragging the size of my text block I can set the size of that to say 5 mils in bold and then um, in in this little palette the uh, that little button that says insert auto text if you click on that it sort of um, shows you all the different areas of auto text available to you so I can insert system information things like the date the file name if I wish even the time the time is helpful to have on the title block if you do a number of prints through the day you know which one is the latest but there's also things like the info box that I showed you in the file pull down menu you can go in and add the project name and the status and things like that uh, you can go in and add your name or the clients name but let's uh, quickly go in and I think uh, the project names been added so I'm going to insert that uh, let's I can alter control H on the keyboard can stretch that text um, I can drag that up in into my title block uh, and I'm sure you will spend a bit of time setting all this information out properly um, and things like uh, say the drawing number so I'll add a drawing number in here say uh, 8 mils high in bold I can insert a piece of uh, text this time I'd have to go to layout and add in the layout number insert uh, and it will sit in there now um, that's a start of a title block I'm sure you could spend a bit of time and uh, design a much more interesting one but let's have a look at how to apply that to a drawing so I can go to a drawing uh, this one is using this first uh, master sheet. I suppose master sheets, if you can think of them a little bit like if you've, if you've used uh, uh, Microsoft PowerPoint, if you think of a, a master sheet a little bit like a master slide, anything on a master sheet can appear on any drawing that you apply it to. So if I wanted to apply my new title block to this sheet, I can go down to settings and I can choose uh, a the, the sheet that I've just created and what it's done is it, it has applied my new title block to this sheet uh, there's a number of ways you could have done it I could also have applied it this way but uh, you can see that because this is layout number one it has automatically put that number in if I was to create a new sheet down here I can create a new layout and choose my A3 master create uh, I, it will um, automatically add a number and so I can uh, jump from this sheet which is number one to this sheet which is automatically being numbered number two now if I ever wanted to uh, if I wanted to change the name of any of the information in the info box I can go in there and change that to something else say OK and it automatically updates and it would apply that to every drawing that I have used that title block in okay so um, my suggestion is spend a bit of time uh, make sure you understand what information needs to go into a title block first and then try and create your own title block 